Ladies and gentlemen, the tour has returned. Thanks for joining us again. We do appreciate your patronage. Now, I'll deal with that. It's all right. I smell peanuts. Has somebody had peanuts? I, uh, peanut butter. He <laughs> <laughs> just went upstairs to change the heat and just ate peanut butter. Well, Shmi was eating peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> okay, He's like, right. we need the poo up there. Yeah. He's in a jar. He's like, Ugh. Okay, yeah, that's, well, he does do that. So I got the hankering. Peanut butter is good. It's, it's, very good. it's really good, don't get me wrong. Now, Tor's back. Thanks for joining us. This is something that is, uh... This guy has a little bit of Winnie the Pooh going on too, huh? No, I just, there's... It's, well, never mind. Let's see. Here's a bear what? Nothing. I just... What, Christian no. Brothers? Mess it, Bob. No, it's not, it's not bad. It's just... What? Well, I just... What do you... Well, you what? I can't What? Say. I can't say it. I'm too... You can say it. I can't. What can't you say? Uh, never mind. Let's, let's forget it. Christian Brothers honey is the ultimate in smoothness, the infusing ultimate. pure natural honey with the rich taste of Christian Brothers brandy, distilled from premium grape varietals and aged in hand selected varietals. oak, I guess, yeah, right. selected oak barrels. Enjoy straight on the rocks or with your favorite mixer. So Christian Brothers is apparently a type of brandy. Yep. It is. They've decided to add honey to their bottle by brand. bottle by CB Vineyards from Bardstown, Kentucky. I've never had it's, uh, honey 30, brandy. Uh, yeah, thirty-five percent alcohol. I actually have high hopes for this one. I'm kind of a fan of brandy, and I love honey. Hey, you love honey. <laughs> <laughs> I love Hundy. <laughs> I love Hundy. Brandy and Hundy. <laughs> okay. Mm, okay. Smells good. Christian Brothers out. Oh, yeah. Very smooth. Or, well, very smooth. Very sweet, should I say. Yeah. Very nice. Oh. I knew you like it. Oh. It's sweet, so. Oh. It's just, the only thing for Josh that makes this a little better is add a little dash of sugar. Just put a sugar cube. Just put in a sugar there. cube in there. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's good, actually. Really yeah. good. Yeah, it's nice. What? What are you looking at? I'm just looking at you. That's all. Why are you looking at me? Because I feel about like something stupid was getting ready to come out of your mouth. When has that ever happened? <laughs> Fair enough. This is good though. You can you can taste the brandy in it too. Mm -hmm. Got a nice little kick. Mm -hmm. Pretty pretty smooth, a little bit of a burn, but you expect that. What is this? Do you say 40%? Yeah. 35. 35. Very, very, as you'd imagine with the brandy, I'm sure. Very rich in honey. Yeah. A lot of that. Yeah. Because brandy's rich as it is. I mean, brandy's, you know. If you like your flavors I bold. I don't know if she's rich or not. Uh, no, brandy's real rich and sweet. I don't know how she's doing now. She could be. I, I don't know what she's doing. I don't know what she's doing. I know she's alive. I don't know what she's doing. Oh, to. Moesha! Is that her? Yeah, Moesha was Brandy. It was the same girl. And Brandy is Moesha. <laughs> Dude, is it really the same? Yes, yeah, it's the same. same. The R&B person Brandy was Moesha. Okay, I didn't follow. So what was Moesha? Like a TV show, right? Yes. It was a TV show on, I don't know. Okay, so it's like Miley Cyrus. Obviously, Miley Cyrus Montana. is Hannah Montana. Hannah Montana, Hannah Montana Miley okay. Cyrus site. Um, Brothers, no. I love watching those older shows, yeah. Fresh Prince and all, yeah. on Fresh like, Prince new, on, like so new TVs good. where it's obvious that they filmed this stuff in, right. you know, yeah. totally, for modern day, totally terrible resolution and everything. And so it's obviously that they just blew the picture up to put it in HD yeah. and it looks so much fucking worse. Yeah. I, I don't like watching HD these days. Oh, that's because you're insane. Like on the normal HD TV, I watch like a show on HD. It's so clear you can tell when props are props, and it looks it looks yeah. like everything's recorded on like a camcorder. I don't dig it. When I watch TV, I want to be sucked into the world. I don't want to see that so, props are props. So um, try turning off. See if your TV has motion interpolation. I think what kind of TV do you have? What brand? Panasonic or something. I think Panasonic. Okay, I'll have to look up what the term for it is. But you turn that off. That's that that what it does is it adds frames in. To oh, make it more smooth, okay, but okay. it'll make it look like a video camcorder recording or something like and that. Unless it's a Christian Brothers TV, we're not talking about it right now. Since when has he been stay on topic, man? Yeah, He's yeah. the worst at that. And yet now you guys are the topic. Christian Brothers. Yeah. You guys now, watch uh, HG, HGTV you think about it? The, the Property Brothers? Brothers? That's a good show. No, right. the, the yeah. vagina's a word, the awful, the, that is the most awful idea. That was way too sensual the way you just touched that. I... 
don't think it's that bad of an idea. So it's a better idea to talk about that and talk about what you would do to that. It's related. Than, than to talk about. It's related. Than to talk about. If TVs are not related to the booze. I almost don't want to drink anything in here. Who knows if he stuck his penis? God, in I know it's scary. How could I fit my penis in that? We don't know. I'm pretty sure you could. I couldn't even try to push it soft into that. I you couldn't try. try to even mash it in there. How wide is it? You could try. Oh, you'd fit. <laughs> yeah, right. First of all, you have yeah, to see right. You can balls. You can fit your balls in there too, probably. <laughs> no. Oh hell. Oh, okay. <laughs> we looked at all the the stuff today at work. Law well, office is very professional. Uh -huh. Um, they had a, my uncle saw on the, on the website, they had a ball stretcher. Ball stretcher to make them longer. So yeah, when you put said, weights, on, it puts said, weights on it and pulls? Yeah, I said, who, who the fuck would want their balls longer? No, people longer? do that with their dick to try to, like, stretch it. Yeah, but that just ends in, like, nerve damage and bad yeah. things happening. That's no good. But it was a ball stretcher. Like, who wants their balls longer? Like, yeah. I know your balls aren't very long, but that's just yeah. a natural occurrence. Yeah. Who really, who really looks down and is like, I don't want them you know what the ladies stretcher. would like? If my balls were down another three yeah. inches, I bet I'd get laid a lot more. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, what the hell? Hey, uh, yeah, ladies out there, l let us know if you like long balls. If anything, right, so if anything, you want your balls to come up a little bit so you, you don't become a randallion. So Write right. in if you like long balls. So let's go ahead and give this a rating. <laughs> yeah. let's go. We'll give you an address at the end of this episode if you're into long balls. So we're going to go ahead and give this right a rating well. Finally, give this a rating. However, I want, do want to point out something. You, you can tell this isn't the highest class stuff ever, and here's why. Why? Yeah, it's cheap. <laughs> look at, bottles look at how uneven... Okay, so you have these little spaces here where the, where the labels go. Look at how uneven this thing is. You placed. moved it. No, I didn't. You moved it. No, I didn't. I mean, it's fucking was. way off this side. It's way right against this side. It's a fucking machine. It just slaps it on right. there. Right. You do not find that in high-end stuff. Not at all. Uh, Their labels are I'm not perfect. holding that against them. That's, that's I'm not either. I'm not holding it against them. I think it's funny. Well, Eric's a very fancy man, you see. He's fancy. My rating on this one, I'll give it a 7. I think it's good for what it is. It's nice. The honey flavor's there. It's very sweet. Uh, I prefer honey whiskey, uh, just because I prefer whiskey in general. But it's good. I like it. 7. This is very good. I'm going 7.5. It's really good. I'm going to go 7.5. Very pronounced honey flavor. If you dig honey and you like bold flavors, this is pretty good. Yeah. 7.5. Dave. A seven and two Dave. seven and a half. Apologize again Dave. for the episode. Predict. You don't want to join us again, understood. We'll be back. <laughs> Apologize again for the episode. <laughs>